Yo guys, what's good? Man, it's your boy Dre back with another video. This video is different, all right? I'm doing a Q&A. You guys can see, man, I just woke up. It is now 6.30 a.m. in the morning, man. I'll be up early, you know what I'm saying? I don't really sleep like that, you feel me? So, um, when I don't have anything to do, I just make a simple video. Now, if you guys not follow me on Instagram or Snapchat, follow me. It's on the screen right there. Um, I went on Instagram and Snapchat, and I asked you guys to... Send me questions, you know what I'm saying? Q&A on what you guys want to know about me. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, I woke up this morning, dude, and I changed out my do-rag. I always switch out my do-rags every morning. I don't know why I became a habit, but um, I'm pretty sure you guys remember this do-rag. I was lazy with it, so I didn't put the flaps all the way around. I just woke up, tied it, like just tied it around, just on some lazy stuff, you know what I'm saying? But um, it's pretty dope wearing it like this. But, um... Let's get to some of these answers. Now, I'm going off of Instagram um, instead of Snapchat because I got more questions asked on Instagram than Snapchat. So, these are questions that you guys asked me, so I'm going to answer them. You know what I'm saying? So, if you guys ever want to know anything about me, just go to my Snapchat and Instagram on the screen and just ask me questions. I'll make a video about it. You know, you know what I mean? Because I know I don't, you guys don't know a lot about me, but most of you guys know that I do 360 way videos. That's about it. But let's let's see what we got. All right, um, let's pull them up. I'm on Instagram right now. Let me show you guys. So these are all like the uh, the questions you guys sent. So I'm gonna you know answer answer them. You know what I'm saying? So if you guys wanna ask me questions, just follow my Instagram and send me the questions, bro. So the first one is from John Yeg. I sent you a DM about brushes. Can you help me out? Now when it comes to the DMs, bro, so many people send me DMs, you know. They want to know this question. They want to know where I got this at. They want to know how you do this. Um, how many times should you do this, do that? And there's, it just got overwhelmed over time. Before I was able to write back everyone, but then it got to a point to where it just non-stopped. You know what I'm saying? So I try my best to answer everyone and then turn everyone's you know photo into a video and then everyone's question into a video. So that's why I'm doing this Q&A, you know what I'm saying? Um, a lot, a lot of you guys may be wondering, you know, the same thing. So that's why I'm doing this Q&A. So he asked about, I sent you a DM about brushes. Can you help me out? I haven't seen your DM. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know what you want to know about brushes. So um, the next question is from Mag. Mag I don't, bro, some of you guys' names is hard to read, bro. I know it's not your real name, but some of you guys' you know, name is hard to read. But he, he was like, I like your feed. I really appreciate that, bro. Thank you. Um, my Instagram, I just upload, you know, photos of like my photos and videos of my hair and then uh, outfits. You know what I'm saying? Um, I do want to, other than doing 360 waves, I do want to, you know, model clothing. You know what I'm saying? So if any companies want to send their clothing, I do like to, you know what I'm saying, take photos and clothes and then show off my waves, you know, because waves make, waves make the style way better. You feel me? So that's another thing I would like to do other than 360 waves, you know? Um, next is from Romel, Romel NYC. Do you ever do collabs? And if so, when are we going to work together? Do I do collabs? Um, I mean, I do videos with other people like girls, but if you mean like collabs with like other YouTubers, um, bro, I'm in Arizona. There's not many YouTubers in Arizona. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's not many of them. There's a few of them. Uh, but to name any of them off the, off the top, there's there's like a few of them, and you guys all know who they are. But um, if I was to ever do a collab, yeah, I'll do a collab. But if it's like doing collabs with like uh, like uh, like other people that are not YouTubers, then yeah, I've got videos like that. But if it's with YouTubers, then nah, I've never done a collab with another YouTuber. But I would like to do that, like basketball. You know what I'm saying? Um, another question is how to get in touch with a girl you never talked to. So those of you who want to get in touch with a girl that you never talked to, you know what I'm saying? Um, bro, just, I don't know, be yourself, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know how to get in touch with a girl you, you never talked to. So that question can mean different different reasons it can mean different things you know how to get in touch with somebody 
you don't live around or someone who lives across you know country or state whatever it could go that way or it could go how to get in touch with a girl you never talk to it could be like how do you or you mean like how do you talk to a girl that you never talk to maybe around your school i don't know but if it's someone that lives across state from you i don't know just message them that's the only way you can get in touch with them message them or if you want to get in touch with someone at your school or whoever you like that lives around you bro just be yourself go up to them you feel me be respectful ask them on a date i don't know bro ask them their name compliment them you know what i'm saying go on about your day because then next time you see that girl she's gonna remember that compliment and then she's probably gonna compliment you and that's where you guys go on from there or if you compliment her she says thank you or i like this about you then th there you go you got in touch with her so it can go either way um godly said is a is waves a permanent hairstyle for you um bro i've been doing waves for like six years bro you know if i can calculate um let me see how long have I been doing it. You know, I've actually been doing waves for about like nine, ten years. For a long time. You know, I started when I was very, very young. So to think about it, I've been doing it for like nine to ten years. Uh is it a permanent hairstyle? Yeah. It's gonna bro waves I don't see no other hairstyle I can go with. You know what I'm saying? So three sixty waves would be like the permanent my permanent hairstyle. If I was to do any other waves, I'll, I mean, if I was to do any other hairstyle, I'll let my hair grow. And then I'll just get like like little braids that hang down. You know what I'm saying? I'll do that. That's about it. But other than that, I'm stuck with waves. Um, what is your motivation to grind harder on YouTube? Because you be posting a lot. So, because he wants to know what am I... What am I after? You know what I'm saying? I post a lot on YouTube, like... What is my motivation to grind harder on YouTube because I post a lot? So you're basically saying like, what motivates me to post a lot? Um, bro, when I was younger, I always wanted to, you know, help people. I always wanted to help people in some kind of way. You know what I'm saying? So the reason why I post a lot is because I like to help you guys get 360 waves. Even though the videos may be the same over and over and over, but you got to think about it. Every day, it's a new waiver. Every day, there's a, there's a new, there's a new waiver that wants to know certain information. You feel me? So. Like I said, I was younger, I wanted to help people out a lot. So that's what keeps me, um, that's what keeps me uh, making videos and keeps me motivated, bro. Can I get a free do-rag? No, you cannot get a free do-rag, bro. I know I got a lot of do-rags, okay. Um, and you guys want free do-rags, but you gotta think about it, man. Um, if, you, if, you're not, if you're not that age to understand, um, Shipping does cost, you feel me? If you want to ship something to somebody, it does cost. And shipping it free, yeah. You, you know what I'm saying? So, um, I don't have anything to give away that's for free unless you're in Arizona. You know what I'm saying? But the only thing I do give away is gift cards, um, etc. So, all you got to do is subscribe, click the thumbs up button, and watch the full video. If you're still watching, you could have easily won a gift card. You feel me? So... Um, another thing is, how old are you? I am a thousand years old. Bro, I would, I don't know when I'll tell you guys my age. I don't know, bro. Like, like I said, I'm a very private person. I don't really put my business out on social media. You know what I'm saying? Um, another guy said, also, can I get waves with a medium brush only? Of course, bro. You can get waves with a medium brush. You feel me? Like, when I cut my hair and I brush it, I use a medium brush. I use a medium brush. I can use a medium brush whenever. I don't have to use a softy. You know what I'm saying? You can get waves with a medium brush. I don't see why not. But with a hard brush, yeah, but your hair has to be long. Not like a medium brush, but you can use it when it's long and short. So you can get waves with a medium brush. You know what I'm saying? So if someone asked me how long, how long should I wait to wash my hair after a cut as a beginner? Me, my opinion, bro, I always wash my hair after a haircut. You know what I'm saying? Because you got to think about it. Your hair is getting cut, right? You have all those all those loose hairs in your scalp, right? You ever wake up and you got hair on your pillow? You ever wake up, you brush your hair, and you got all those loose hairs in your brush? Guess what? Every time you brush your hair, it's going right back in that brush. Your brush is getting dirty. Dandruff. Loose hair. 
you put on that do-rag, you got loose hair in your, in your do-rag, dandruff. You have it on your pillow. Now you got it everywhere. That's why I always wash my hair after a cut. You're gonna lose progress, of course. Of course. But when, once your hair grows back and you brush, 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 your progress will come back. It's not gonna disappear forever. So that's why I always wash my hair after a haircut, bro. It makes sense. I don't like dirty do-rags. I don't like dirty brushes. I like everything clean, bro. You know what I'm saying? I want to be able to put on a clean do-rag. I want to be able to brush with a, a clean brush. I want to be able to lay down on a clean pillow. Wake up with a clean pillow. Not hairy everywhere. That's just how I am, bro. I like to stay clean. You feel me? Even though I lose progress, but when my hair grows back, my, my progress comes back. It's not going anywhere, bro. You know what I'm saying? How long do you, how long, how did you look before waving? I don't know how I looked before I was waving. I know I had a, like a little afro. Um, before I started waving, I had like a, a, a small afro about like that thick, you know what I'm saying? And I had it like taped up, that's about it. And then I just, uh, I had a friend who, who showed me his waves and I was like, dang, I want that. So I started getting 360 waves, I put my mind to it. I gave up a few times, but then I kept going. You know what I'm saying? Bro, I'm so chill right now, like there's so many questions. I don't even know if you guys are still watching with me. If you're still watching, give it a thumbs up, bro. I really appreciate it. Um, that just shows that, you know, you guys want to know a lot about me. Because I don't put a lot on the internet. You know what I'm saying? Um, another one. Is it fun to live in Arizona? Uh, my opinion, um, it's pretty boring. You know what I'm saying? Arizona is a desert, a dry desert. There's not a lot here. Only thing that you can do is basically go to the clubs. That's all you can do bro it's just club 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 you can't go you can't go anywhere where there's a there's a beach you know what i'm saying i mean you got water world sun splash stuff like that you know but in arizona the main hype is the weekends the club it's not like la where you can go to the beach it's not like miami we can go to the beach you know what i'm saying that's where all the hype is at you feel me arizona the hype is the club that's it you know what I'm saying? Because it's super hot. Like, what what can you do? It's just the club. That's it. That's all you can do. So, um, Arizona is pretty boring. It's just, just the heat. That's all it is. We don't get any other crazy things. Just the heat. Um, what do you do for a living in trying to... What do you do for a living? I'm trying to be like you. See, that? Now that's another personal thing. Like I said, I'm very private. I don't really put my business out. People want to know what I do for a living because... I'm very private, I don't tell people what I do, you know? Um, I feel like, you know, your life is your life. You know, you do what you do in your life. You don't have to explain it to anyone. I'm not saying that, you know, I don't have to explain to you, but I just keep my life private. Um, what moisturizer do you use? I, bro, I've used plenty of moisturizers. I've, I've tried all kinds of pomades. I've tried Sporting Waves. I've tried 360 Style. Um, I've tried, my recently I've tried All Natural butter and I just realized that I do not like it anymore because it don't lay my hair down as much as pomade does so um, I'm through with the uh, all natural butter so just get you some any pomade get you any all natural butter you know all natural butter might work for you, you know what I'm saying how do you keep your waves more shiny so when it comes to shiny it's the oil bro put oil in your hair and moisturizer your hair is moisturized but first, your hair has to be clean. You can't have dirty dandruff, you can't have loose hair. Your hair has to be dark. It has to be clean if you want that shine. So when you put those products in, your hair is gonna shine and it's gonna be dark. So it's the products, the pomade, the oil, the moisturizer. Just keep your hair moisturized as a coarse hair waver. You feel me? And your hair will shine, trust me. <laughs> All right, I got one more, man. Let's see. Um. All right, this is good right here. If waves never existed, what hairstyle would you rock? Um, I wouldn't even know. That, that's that's a good question, but it's also hard. Um, I, I probably still stick with the afro, bro, with the tapers. You feel me? All uh, right, last one. When, when you wash in style, do you rinse out your hair with hot or cold water? Now, I rinse out my hair with warm water, all right? I used to do it with cold water. But I feel like cold water made my hair drier. 
don't know if that made that, that makes sense, but I rinse out warm water when I'm doing a washing style. Cause eventually when you put your products in, your hair is gonna get back moist and it's gonna, you know what I'm saying? So warm water, bro. But that's all I got for y'all, man. Thank y'all so much for the questions. If you guys ever wanna know anything about me, my Snapchat, my Instagram, Snapchat, Instagram is on the screen. Instagram, Snapchat, it's on the screen, bro. Go follow me. Whatever you wanna know, whatever videos you guys want me to make, whatever you wanna send me, photos, questions, send it to me because there may be more people who are having that same problem and I can make a video about it and I can upload it, you know what I'm saying? So thank y'all so much for watching. And as always, if you ain't brushing, I'm brushing. Let me unrag for y'all. Cause every time I wear a do-rag, y'all always tell me to unrag, bro. So this is a new edition do-rag that I've received. Pretty dope, these are like teeth. And then um, you have like the eyes right here. So this is pretty dope. But let me unrag for y'all real quick. Show y'all how my hair looking. It's pretty laid down. The lighting is terrible in here. But that's how my hair is looking right now. Pretty dope. But thank y'all so much for watching. It's your boy Dre. And if you not brushing, bro, I'm brushing. Peace.